Hi everyone, it's Anna here from EP State Team. Welcome back to our channel. Today I'm super excited to show you something really special. In this video, we'll dive into the VP Residence Studio plugin and I will walk you through the process of creating stunning pages with the VP Residence pre built demo templates. VP Residence has been a top choice for real estate professionals, providing powerful uh, options and beautiful designs. But now we've taken it a step further with the Elementor Design Studio by offering you all the templates we have created with Elementor from our 46 VP Residence demos in one place. And remember, more demos are added with each team update. So let's get started. To install the VP Residence team, which is the first step, you first need to have the latest team version VP Residence 4.22. Once you have updated or installed this team version, you will have a notice to install the VP Residence element or Design Studio plugin from Appearance Install Plugins. Simply follow the steps to install and then activate the plugin. With the plugin install, you will notice a new menu items called VP Residence Studio Templates. This is used to add headers and footers with the new studio tool, which I presented in a previous video. Besides giving you the possibility to create custom headers and footers with Elementor, the VP Residence Elementor Design Studio plugin gives you instant access to all the professionally designed templates and pages from our 46 VP Residence demos, the pages we have created with Elementor. First, let's explore the templates. We have a tab set dedicated to sections such as about agents, properties, contact, and so on. You can filter them by using the drop down on the left. And there is a tab dedicated to pages from our demos, pages we have created with Elementor. You will see there mostly the home pages and about us pages. I will show you how you can use the templates to create a new page or to add a specific session in an existing page. So first I will create an About Us page as a page example. I will add a new page from admin dashboard pages and new. I will add a title and I will make sure Elementor full width template is selected so the page looks white. And remember that you still need to control the appearance options like header and how the search looks from team options before you start editing the page. To import a template, I have to click Edit with Elementor first. This is what I'm doing now. Importing a template is a breeze. Simply look for the template you like, select it, and then click Import. And watch as it seamlessly integrates to your website. In just a few moments, you can have a stunning professional template imported in your site. Now let's dive a little bit into customizations. With Elementor, you can edit every aspect of this template. So you can change images, you can edit the text, you can make changes to the width, content, and margins, and so on. You select the container you wish to edit, and then you can manage the Elementor advanced settings or styling to change the position. Like for example, I'm changing the margin top position of this container. To see the changes you make, you have a view page icon that lets you see a preview of the page as it shows to other users. And if you wish to make further changes that are not in Elementor, like for example, set a transparent header, I will show you how, you make the option apply from edit page, and then you can see the changes in front end as I'm showing you now. I will make another change in Elementor. I will go to the first section and from style, I will change the image I want to show in the header. Simply select the image from your media and then click insert to see it there. Same way we can simply select the element you wish to edit and details such as text are easy to modify from Elementor. You can also make changes to any section in this page using Elementor Editor. And you can continue making edits to every part of a template you import so that it matches the content you wish to display. When you are done, simply click on Save Changes and then you can preview the modifications in front end. I will show you how you can do the same by importing just a specific session in an existing page created with Elementor. For example, I wish to delete the testimonials I have imported with this template. So I select the Design Studio and from the drop down, I select testimonials. Here you can see all the testimonial sections we have added as templates and more will be added on the way as we create new demos. I click insert to add my new template in the page. The template you insert will be showing at the end of the page, but you can use drag and drop to move the section to your desired position in the page. As I'm doing now, I use drag and drop to place the testimonials above the page. 
Once you have positions, your new section where you wish it to show, you can start editing right away using the Elementor editor. As shown before, you can text, you can edit the text, you can edit style, you can edit colors, and so on. We wrap our video here. Remember to install the VPRS Dance Elementor Design Studio plugin today and start using these awesome new options to design your website. Thank you for tuning in and stay tuned for our next videos.